moving lightweight. Hi, hi, you with the plug, I'm with them every day. Mouth still dope. I did this shit all on my own, amen, amen. And he talking like he the plug. I spread my wings, I fly away like a ship. I said, where do you put this band? And he said, we're getting a lot of dumb comments about where we're putting it, so. There's different places. It's not right or wrong. It just depends where you want to challenge, right? It all depends on your goal, the exercise. So, this is a good place to start learning this. Sweet. He's so, he's got a place right there on his back. Pause the bottom. Right, before you contract, contract, and now squeeze through. Don't swing it through. Ah, it's your best rep. Squeeze first. Keep that tension on. Keep that tension on. Elbows in. Elbows in. Ah, your money rack. Ooh. Yeah, that's a big difference. I think you're strong pushing 125s. Try uh, some 50s. What well, 50s will feel like 125s? <laughs> I feel serious. And it's just such good tension because, like you said, usually you get the fall off right here. But here it's all the way through and he's really saying to work on that contraction. So. So pushing up, push your elbows out because you want the tension, right? Nice. So elbows. So resist, push out against my hands on the way out, on the way down, sorry. Push against my hands. Out, 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 out. So much harder that makes now it. Push against, now push into my hands. Push into my hands, push into my hands. Good. Just squeeze harder. Good. Reach out, reach out. <laughs> Dude. I don't think I've ever felt a better chest bump, I swear. That is insane. Guys, we're just warming up. I know. <laughs> wow. All right, so straight line is just taking their arm up to 90 and setting the seat height so that they don't, they're reaching, they don't reach down and they don't reach up. Straight lines. Way mark, I want you to start straightening out your arms. Okay? Yeah. And drive, elbows together. Humors, that was the best rep, okay? To make it more challenging. That was your money rep. Now you need to hang out where it's short for two seconds. All right. This is the best part of the movement. Don't skip the best part of the movement right here. Hang out a little more. Squeeze harder. That's it. You gotta train your body to recruit muscle in the hardest part. That's it. Spend some time here. Spend some time here. Squeeze hard. There you go. Close the gap. Squeeze harder. Squeeze harder. One, two. Good. Squeeze off swing, baby. Yeah. I never thought lifting such light weight compared to what I'm used to would feel so dang heavy. Go. The pump is so real. It feels great lifting with Vince. He's been teaching us a lot. And if you guys like this video and want to see more, make sure to smash that like button. Comment down below, and we'll make it happen. So it's basically reverse engineering what your what your goal is. So if your goal is to get the pecs short, create tension on the pecs, we have to understand the pecs and, and adductor of the humerus. So where can we create challenge to adduction that the machine doesn't provide? So if we add bands right here, we can see that there's a direct line of pull against the pec if we place these right here. So now Instead of just having a force that's going through more of the shoulders and triceps, we can now create a more direct force through the pec. So when we're pressing here, 
not only do we have to push these things up, which is what most of us get good at, and build great shoulders and triceps, but we now have to think about driving elbows together. This will jack up your chest. Don't just go out and buy some cheap little jack, because big jacks aren't all that expensive. I bought my jacks at Harbor Freight Tool when they're on sale, and they only cost 60 bucks a piece. And up she goes. Now we're actually applying resistance to the part of the movement that engages the pecs the most, which is the part that this machine neglects just because of its design. So we can turn this into an exercise that helps us achieve our goal. We've now taken control of our workout. This is definitely one that's okay to work with a spotter because this is where you're weakest and this is where the weight's the heaviest. So it makes sense to have somebody help you through that last few in those last few inches because you can't keep this muscle short by yourself. That's good. All right, man, that's one in the books. We appreciate it. That was some solid stuff. Absolutely. Taking it back to that hard physique building yeah. base, right? It's fun, man. Yeah. Making gains on baby weights. That's yeah. it. Gains on baby weights. Like I said, guys, if you haven't subscribed to Vince already, great channel, great content. Now's your time. Oh, thanks. I appreciate uh, it. First link in the bio. We'll hook them up. So make sure you hit them up. Smash that like button. Want to end it? Yeah. Until next time. And make sure to subscribe to everyone. Leave a comment, any suggestions. We're always open to make cool videos. We want to help you guys out. And uh, we'll see you guys later. I spread my wings and I fly away like I should. Amen. Amen.